this. And my thinking is the opposite. Because there's so many, there's so much anger out there right now, is that um, maybe the Libertarian Party in the next election, they should really get their everybody in line because I think, you know, we have two minutes to talk about this, but I think that, you know, that's where they should really start focusing, getting on these talk shows and really talking about what we're talking about today. And we're just kind of um, barely touching on most of these things. Mm. So what do you feel about that? Yeah, I mean, I think the Libertarian Party needs to expand its base with kind of a broad message of decentralization that the states, the localities, the people can handle things that the central government typically does. Um, we need to get past 5% to be declared a national uh, major party. Uh, and we need to have state organizing uh, committee representatives represent, um, you know, kind of exchange information between the state and the local chapters. We want people to come to the local chapter meetings. Um, they're not as fun as the events that we have, like parades and stuff. So if you're bored by chapter meetings, you can always come to those. So yeah, we, uh, we're gonna be looking for um, local and state uh, candidates that are running in um, jurisdictions all over the country right now. And we have at least three people who are probably gonna run for president uh, for the LP in 2020. That's good. But really, the most important thing, Joe, is that they need to get their message out. They have to explain uh, what libertarianism is, how it differs from uh, socialism, communism, um, anarchism. You know, there's so many different isms out there that, uh, you know, people are kind of confused. And I think the most important thing is to get the message out, to get, you know, um, like you're doing today, and, and try to identify, you know, you can't vote on something you don't know uh, about. And I think that's what they need to have, where town hall meetings, where they can meet, uh, they come out to different places instead of going where you are, they can come to where everybody else is. Mm -hmm. Thank you again, Joe. I see our credits are going down, and I want to welcome you back because we're just touching a little bit on everything. We want to come back and talk about uh, your n next book, Soft Communism for 90s Kids. I love that title. And more about libertarianism and the conspiracy theories that we need to really uh, work on and what these conspiracy theories are. And I think that's so important that, you know, that people kind of have to...